Okay, so now let's talk about an interesting marriage that's happened over the past couple of weeks, which is VAM Sprint SF and Valorec.smart and Smart and Go with a customer that we have in West Texas uh, who has just run this new connection using these digital services. Let's let's talk a little bit about what's gone over what's gone on over the past couple of weeks. Yeah, thanks, Eric, for the question. Um, so starting with uh, the activity that we did in the yard to prepare the pipe for us to run, we took um, pipe that was uh, threaded in Youngstown, Ohio, um, delivered with uh, Kindex, and we took that pipe, laid it all out, did a full visual inspection. We drifted the pipe, um, did a laser tally, and then also did some things that uh, Will will talk about in a moment to um, create some digital traceability that we could then use um, at the rig site. So once the uh, pipe was rig prepped, um, we also performed a uh, delivery on site um, for the rig. This was really important for us and important for the customer because we took a delivery that could traditionally take um, anywhere from you know 10 to 12 hours. We boiled that down to about three and three and a half hours. And we did that with a, a very close collaboration with Valorec and um, and the tools that uh, Valorec has to offer. The field service guys um, were there to lay out all the pipe and do some of the things that were tr traditionally done by roustabouts and the uh, and the rig crews. And then this helped um, facilitate the uh, digital delivery. So once, once we did the rig prep, uh, two to three days later, it was time to uh, run the pipe. So field service did its traditional suite of activities, in which case we did um, running supervision. We checked um, alignment, dope quantity, dope consistency, and also um, makeup. We did that together with a torque turn because we were also running the torque turn for that uh, job. And then we also provided all of the tools. So stabbing guides, quick release protectors, uh, lift nubbings and also um, crossovers and well control. Um, in addition, we were able to um, put into practice some of the Valorec.smart and Smart and Go uh, digital tools that Will will talk about. So, Joe, it sounds like there were fewer people on the well site for, uh, and those that were on the well site were on the well site for less time. Talk about what that does for safety and, and risk to to employees. Yes, sir. Yeah, you're exactly right. So it, this was kind of a, um, uh, a double win for the customer and a double win for us. Um, HSE is always an important um, uh, concept for the rig, but also for, for Valoric and for VAM. So making sure that from the time the first truck got here to the last truck left, um, and also making sure that we had as few people as possible inside the buffer zone at the active rig site was very important for us. And so we were able uh, with these tools and this collaboration to um, really exploit that and really deliver on that. Um, and then in terms of uh, rig running also, we kept the, the rig personnel to, um, to a minimum by having uh, the field service uh, technician who would normally uh, manage all of those activities I mentioned before. He's also able in tandem to do the uh, smart and go suite, which uh, makes sure that we keep the uh, the people on board the rig uh, as, uh, as small as possible. 